Hey guys, it's John, and welcome back to Emily Wants to Play. We're gonna give this game another shot. Continue. So, uh, it's currently Sunday, December 13th, and um, I meant to have another Silent Hill downpour video up today, but those 35 to 40 minute videos take a while to cut together, so I'm a little behind on that. Sorry. I decided I wanted to record more of this game though. A lot of people requested it, and uh, we're gonna see if we can't beat it. I'm not sure how much time there is, or uh, you know how long the night goes, but we'll we'll check it out. <laughs> so I was gonna say there's a secret in this room that everybody told me about. And we're gonna check it out. That's right. Give up. So it's in this closet. Somebody said something about a lamp. And, uh, apparently, I did something here. Oh! And I also have my flashlight. Oh! Not sure what that was about. What? Okay. So there's some story back here, apparently. We were scared of our own daughter. She was standing in our bedroom last night, staring at us. We're going to start walking her down in the basement. Hmm. We're gonna start locking her down in the basement? A hole fell through Emily's old room into the other side of the basement today. We know Emily had something to do with it, but we don't understand what's going on. Okay. We bought her a puppy. It was so cute. We thought it would help her. Poor puppy. Emily didn't like it. Okay. Well, this is uh, very enlightening so far. I went down in the basement today to bring Emily some food. She was laying on the floor lifeless. She wasn't breathing. She didn't have a pulse. She didn't have any injuries. We can't go to the police. How can we explain this? Leave me alone, Chester. Wait, are you just gonna stand there? Okay, I guess he doesn't wanna go into this room. It's cool. Is there anything in here? There we go. What the hell? So those are, those are all her friends. Okay. Hi, Chester. What what are you doing exactly? Why are you just are you just hanging out there? Am I invincible in this room? Does time stand still? Where? I guess this is just, uh, this is it. Ooh. Emily's gone, but the dolls keep appearing around the house. I don't know if this is just me imagining it, or if this is really happening. Either way, we have to leave this place. Okay. And we also have to stick a bunch of tape recorders in the basement, apparently. What kind of basement is this? Like, why, why all this stuff? There's chairs. Desks. I mean, was Emily being homeschooled? I mean, there's lockers and everything. Come on, you didn't have to give her a locker. She doesn't need a locker. She's she's at home. I'm really scared to leave. He's gonna get me as soon as I get out of here. Is time passing while I'm in here? Because if it is, I don't want it to like halt the progression. On the other hand, I feel like I'm camping here or abusing a bug somehow. Or maybe time isn't passing when I'm in this room. But none of that makes any sense. I don't know. I just, what is he doing? I feel like as soon as I go out of this doorway, he's gonna kill me. What the hell? What's wrong, Chester? Why don't you... I don't think he's... He's caught on the door! Look! He's like, I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. Oh. Come on, Chester. Oh, no, he's... Can't quite get there. Well, okay, so as soon as I get out of here, he's gonna start running at me again. Okay, I think this is a bug because... It seems that... The doll... And the clown don't spawn while he's out. So then I can just sit here.
I, I did it. I made it to 3 a.m. I guess that was a bug. Wait, it started me here. I don't think that's right. Yeah, Chester seems like he's officially bugged now. Did I break the game? I went down in the basement today to bring Emily some food. She was laying on the floor lifeless. She wasn't breathing. She didn't have a pulse. She didn't have any injuries. We can't go to the police. How can we explain this? Okay, so she's not. He is, though. There was a box of three very strange dogs down in the basement. Emily talks to them as if they can hear her. Maybe it's a good sign. That's the first positive thing in a long time. Okay, well, you know, no Chester. Like, that sounds good. I'll, I'll go with that. Assuming that he's stuck down there forever. Yeah, made to made to four, which uh, instead of a I V, it's an I I I I, which I don't think is four, but it's not the correct Roman numeral. So apparently it's a what? Why are all the lights off? What was that? I hide, you seek. Okay, so that's what everybody was talking about. I hide, you seek in the dark. What? Oh, I hide, you seek, so... Okay, there's two ways you can interpret this. You can either interpret this as we're supposed to do the opposite of that, in which case we're supposed to hide while she seeks, or we're supposed to take it literally and find her. Oh no, I wasn't supposed to turn it on. I'm an idiot, I'm supposed to. I was too busy thinking, I was too busy thinking, shit. All right. So she's either hiding someplace or we're expected to hide. I'm not sure which one it is yet. I guess we'll have to experiment. All right. So I imagine she might be... Back here, no? All right, so you gotta find her. Is this even open? At least I had some friends in the basement. Chester, Kiki, and Mr. Tatters. So these are their names, okay. So we gotta find her. I'm guessing. Or we have to hide. I'm not, I don't really like that one as much. All right. Where are you, Emily? Oh, there's a note here. I take care of my friends and make them pretty. Don't turn around peekaboo. Crap. I'm wasting time finding notes that, for some reason, I hadn't found before. This is not good. There you are! Oh, it resets the timer! It's been over a Shut up! I, I already know the story. Thank you. Thank you. I know what happens. Okay. We can find her, no prob. Although after we, it makes sense once we find her, we should wait like the full uh, time. So like, we found her, right? So in order to maximize our time, we should let it run down to like 10 or, or less. Because that way, you know, no, you guys, you guys, you guys understand what I mean by maximize time. I don't have to explain it. 
Unless unless she starts running like before it, it finishes counting down, which I guess we'll find out in a second. What's she even doing over there? Is she just hiding her hands over her face? All right. There we go. So it resets. And you're not supposed to turn the lights on or else the game is over and she comes and finds you. She gets all mad about it. There she is. Okay, so we should just wait. All right, well this seems pretty simple. I imagine that once we get to 5 a.m., because we're gonna get to 5 a.m., uh, they'll have her with all three of her friends, and that is gonna be crazy, so... I'm looking forward to that. Okay. Oh no, unless I, unless I just straight up missed her. I might have just straight up missed her. Found you. Glad I, glad I went down here, jeez. Wait until like 10, and then we'll... Found ya. Okay, so you're not... The thing is, I gotta, I gotta check the basement while I'm down here, otherwise it's gonna be completely redundant. I'm gonna waste a lot of time. So, assuming that each level is like 5 minutes... We should only have to do this, like this should be the last time that we have to do this. Where are you, Emily? Not in the closet, eh? You out here somewhere? Down to three seconds. Not good. Found her. <sighs> she hasn't been in the same spot twice so far, which is cool. I can't imagine having to do this with the clown stopping me every 10 feet, though. I gotcha. Alright, let's hang out here. Hey, we did it! 5 a.m. Is that it, or are we going to 6? We're going to- we have to go to 6, I would imagine. Okay, we started off in the same area again, which is weird. What does the hint say now? Let's all play. Find me. Fuck. Okay, at least you have 90. I have... Dude. Are you fucking kidding me? Stop that. I had Chester and the clown. I was really... Fuck. <laughs> oh my god, dude. <laughs> Can't... Fuck. Can't... Where is she? Oh well, I, I gotta go. I gotta go. Like, I can't. I can't do this. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> there she is. I, I'm not gonna be able to find her. Fuck, I'm not gonna be able to find her. She must have been in that center room. <laughs> Fuck, how'd you get past the thing? How'd you get past the door? You were hung up on it earlier. Damn. What, where? There she is. Oh God, I don't have time to babysit you. Okay. Stop it! Trying to find your stupid owner. 
Open! Open! My god. Ah, this is... No! <laughs> Are you freaking kidding me? She better be in the basement. Otherwise, I'm screwed. Nope. Where is she? <laughs> oh my god, I have no idea. Was she in the room with me? Did I just not see her? Crap! <laughs> oh my god. Where is she? <laughs> you can't do anything there! If Chester and the clown both spawn, you can't do anything. Like, you, you are dead. That's the only thing you can do, is just die. With, with dignity, I guess. Whatever dignity you can possibly have in that situation. Cause it's like, if you stay still, it's like you're saying to Chester, Hey, you're a bitch. But if you run, it's like you're telling the clown, Hey, you're a bitch, you know? You have to disrespect one of them. Okay. Now we start in here. <laughs> You know, they should at least... God, I can't do this. There's Emily. I don't know where the girl is. Kiki or whatever. This is the first time I've found Emily, I think. As long as Chester isn't around, we should be okay. I'm gonna take advantage of knowing where she is. <laughs> Good. At, at least it's, it, as long as there's not like 10 seconds left when you appear, then we're okay. <laughs> Shit. No, that was mean. <laughs> okay, she's gone. Gotta find her, gotta find her. <laughs> you freaking serious, dude. Leave me alone. Looking for your stupid master. Oh my god! She's in the basement, isn't she? Fuck. Are you fucking kidding me? That's four times in a row, isn't it? No! What the? What? What? Are you supposed to know where he's coming from? Man, I thought I had, oh man. I had a good start to that one. Stop. No, this is stupid. Can I inch past you? Ugh. Emily, are you in here? No.
Stop! Where is she? I never found her. Fuck. <laughs> oh my God. I was like, what happens now? She fell through the ceiling, dude. Man. Hi. No! <laughs> what the? How? He was up there! How did he get down there? That doesn't make any sense. How far did he run? That was not. Ah, uh, that makes me so mad. Uh. I saw him in the hallway. By the way, how. How stupid was that? First she had Kiki, and I was like, all right, I'm going. And then Chester showed up, and I was like, I'm really going now. And Mr. Tatters shows up. There's three at once, it's a triple team. You can't do that to me, it's not fair. It's not fair, this game's not fair. Balance your game properly. Just kidding. Okay. Seems like she has... <laughs> I'm not gonna go in there yet. It's like the basement is kind of a last resort. Like, you don't want to go in there unless you absolutely have to. Because Chester equals death down there. Is she in this big room? If not, she's in the basement. She's in the basement then. She has to be. Because I checked everywhere else. My god. So you're telling me he can't get me even when he's right next to me like that? Come on. Chester hasn't showed up yet, which really makes me upset. Shut up. How? How? I literally looked everywhere. She's not. What? I checked there, I thought. And I got killed by both of them at the same time. Perfect. Okay, so here's the deal. I don't know what I'm doing wrong, but I'm doing something wrong. Because you guys saw me play 4 a.m. to 5. I don't think I died, and I found her with good time every single time. All right, here she is. I say this, and then I find her, so... But this is like the second time I found her out of like 20 tries. Like, period. And I've never found her multiple times. So I'm really confused, like... I don't know. This is, this is just confusing to me. Idiot. All right. I don't know if I can beat this, is my point. So this is, uh... I'm gonna say this is my last try, but like I said, I, I haven't even found her more than once. And I don't understand what I'm doing wrong. I'm gonna wait till there's 10 seconds left and then we'll. Oh, never mind. The clown really, really screws it up. He shaves off 10 seconds. Which, it's nice that they give you an extra 30, you know, but... Like, I need more than that. 
I think. And I swear, too, that she teleports. She's not in here. She has to be in the basement. All right. So the problem with the basement is that Chester, like, basically screws you. I don't know, I, I think I'm okay with not being able to sink in the amount of time required to beat this game. <laughs> uh, to be honest, I don't know, but for whatever reason, I just, I, I can't even get close to beating 5 a.m. and getting to 6. I don't, I even, uh, I even looked up a video actually, full disclosure, um, and 6 a.m. is the end of the game. This is the last part. And, uh, seems like other people were able to find her with, with a lot more regularity than I was. So I don't know. Clearly I'm doing something wrong. Basically, bottom line is I don't really want to uh, invest the amount of time necessary to to beat the game just for, just for a cutscene. So, yeah, that's about it. Uh, if you want to see the ending to the game, there are other people who have beaten this game. So you should be able to find it pretty easily. But uh, yeah, that's it for Emily Wants to Play. We'll be back with uh, other videos later. See you guys then. Think critically. <laughs>